when you're using LinkedIn as a source of email address, you won't always have 100% reliable email. So for instance, here I've been using the LinkedIn profile scraper with email discovery, and I got few email addresses. Um, however, some of them might not be valid. And if I'm going to be plugging them straight away into some email automation, I can have some bounce, which can impact my de uh, de deliverability rate and basically mark me as spam later on. So it is recommended to first check if those emails are valid before plugging it into any email automation tool. To do this, I will be using the email is verified tool, which actually check if all those emails are valid. And I'm using it using this specific phantom that you can have access in the link below. What it's going is going to check for each email address if they are valid or not. And for instance, for this person, the email address is not valid. That can be found for this person left SEMrush and hasn't updated his LinkedIn profile. So he's still appearing there as having an email address from SEMrush. This automation is quite straightforward to use when you go to setup. So you will have few information um, getting from email list verify, which is like API key you can get once you have signed up to services. And then you can select the list of contact you want to be checking out. It is compatible with the new lead feature. So you can straight away get um, list of lead from Lea, from Ambassador Leads, or you can be using a specific uh, URL of a spreadsheet which is accessible, as then you just need to be providing name of the column which has the email address. Or by default, it will be checking email names or first column. Uh, how many email you want to be processing per launch? Uh, it can in theory be up to 10,000, like if you want to be processing big database. And then usually I recommend you to just be running this on ad hoc basis. Um, I don't see that a recurrent launch is relevant. This automation will check if it has already uh, processed one email address. So it will be saving up your credit that it will not try to verify three, four times the same email address.